Hey everyone, it's Eric with FirearmTutorials.com and today we're gonna look at the Federal Plus P Plus. This is the 9BPLE. This round's been around for a long, long time and it is famous in law enforcement circles. I believe the departments that are still using nines are probably still using this ammunition as well. Without going into too much detail, Plus P Plus is as close to a max load as you can get as far as pressure in a nine millimeter. If you want more details, more specifics, there's an article on FirearmTutorials.com that talks about specific uh, plus P plus versus plus P versus standard ammunition. What I want to do today is I've pulled one of these out of the box and we're going to use this little tool to extract the bullet, which we know is going to be 115 grains. But what I'm really interested to see here is how much of a powder charge they're putting in this. We're not going to get exact exact because unfortunately this tool uh, under the course of using it spills a little bit of powder, but we'll get a good idea. So let's go ahead and uh, put it in the hammer here and we'll get going. Okay, so I haven't actually showed a video of how this thing works, so I'll just do it real quickly. This isn't the best tool like this, or best tool for this, like I said, but it gets the job done. So it comes with these little collets, a couple different sizes. You basically put them in like this, and then it's going to grab the actual end of the case there. And we screw it in this little thing here till it's tight, and then we smack it, and the inertia is just going to unseat the bullet. So once we're done, we'll have you know, an empty case, the bullet, and the powder. So, um, depending on how tight these are seated. Okay, so that was it. Took two hits. So, let's go on over to the scale and see what we got. Okay, so we can take the case out. Obviously, this is now just a primed case. We're going to go ahead and dump the bullet and the powder. Oh, there's the bullet itself. Hundred and fifteen point three. There's a tiny bit of powder in there, so pretty close. Now let's see what the rest of the charge is. All right, six point seven grains ish. Oh. It's really up impossible to figure out what kind of powder this is, but for giggles, let's just go ahead and light it up because we're not going to be able to use this for anything. Now I suspect this powder should burn pretty quick. Yep. Not as quick as some of the powder I've seen, but so 6.7 grains, which with 115 grain bullet, I was under the impression that this may have been a compressed load. When I say compressed, I mean that if the powder was coming near the top of the case, when the bullet is seated, it actually crunches down the powder. But uh, I don't think 6.7 grains, that looked like pretty fine powder. So I don't think these are actually compressed loads. But, you know, for those of you guys that have shot this before and were wondering more about it, hopefully this answered some questions. So that's it, guys. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know.